After a month-long investigation, the Attorney General's office says 19-year-old Lane Lesko created a dangerous situation on June 21st in Peterborough. Mr. Lesko had committed an armed robbery that morning. Uh, the police had been told that an armed robbery had been committed, that the subject was armed, was driving a stolen BMW, and that's exactly what the chief encountered. According to the investigation, Lesko committed this crime and others after leaving the Summit Achievement Program in Maine. He left that facility and he ended up committing a series of crimes, looks like in Maine and New Hampshire, where he stole some vehicles. We don't know how he came in possession of the BB gun. Somehow he did, and he used that uh, to commit an armed robbery from a car dealership in Nashua. The AG's office says Greenfield Police Chief Brian G. Marino spotted Lesko driving and tried to pull him over. Lesko then led police on a chase, driving at high speeds. Police laid down spike strips, which caused Lesko to go off the road. At that time, the AG's office says Lesko told officers to shoot and kill him while firing the BB gun at them. He refused the officer's commands. He ended up taking out a black handgun, which looked to be real to the officers there. He pointed at the officers, fired, and then he approached the chief, appeared that he was trying to get at the chief, and that's when the chief fired and unfortunately killed him. The AG's office says the chief's decision to shoot Lesko was justified. He'd had a prior history, unfortunately. Um, it appeared he had some mental health issues. The AG's office says all the officers that responded that day say they thought Lesko's gun was real, although they do admit it sounded different. Again, there will be no charges filed in this case. Live in studio, Kristen Carosa, WMUR News 9.